Today, we're all here to celebrate potential, the potential of some of our most promising student researchers who have demonstrated unparalleled commitment, ambition, and drive. And we're here to celebrate their belief in their ability to make a difference through their work and to improve the nation and more broadly the world for all of us. Today we celebrate Canada's newest Vanier Scholars, leaders who are among the world's top doctoral students and whose pursuit of excellence in their chosen field of study will drive innovation into the future. We are pleased to have these scholars in Canada. In fact, I think we're privileged to have them in Canada. And through this program, we are saying loud and clear that Canada is a major competitor for intellectual talent on the world stage. We are committed to attracting, to training, and to retaining the world's best researchers right here in Canada. Indeed, we have reversed the brain drain. We now have a brain gain in this country. It's important to note that the value of the Vanier scholarships extends beyond the benefit to individual recipients. By attracting and retaining the world's best doctoral students, we are building a culture of innovation and high achievement right here in Canada. This in turn will strengthen our economy and our society creating jobs and prosperity across the country for years to come. Ladies and gentlemen, the reason for such hope and ambition is right here in this room. To mention just a few examples, Carolina Alba, who some of us met this morning, came to Canada from Argentina and is researching new prognostic markers and potential therapeutic options for patients with heart failure. Also studying here at McMaster, Jonathan Lai is seeking to understand the neurological basis of mental illness and to shed light on complex disorders such as autism and fragile X syndrome. The focus of my own research interest is to improve the management of patients with heart failure. Heart failure is a frequent and fatal disease that affects thousands of Canadians and millions of people worldwide. I will specifically study a novel biomarker which may help physicians to improve outcomes of patients with this disease. The opportunity to undertake the, this intensive research training will help us to become independent investigators, but it will also extend Canadian international networks and will act as a bridge for young students looking to develop their academic careers. 